January 17, 2021. Jumana 2, day 4. Jumana 2, day 3. Vlog number 1386. Currently, I'm just adding up the vlog from yesterday, so by the time you're watching this video, yesterday's vlog should already be up. Please be sure to go check it out. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I don't know why I have so many lights on. Mom's gonna be like hating on this. There's really nothing to do. Um, I've mostly been sleeping all day. Um, I woke up earlier and I got, I ate the rest of my ch turkey and cheddar sub um, with a Sprite and I was gonna, oh, and I ate some blueberries um, with that. <sighs> um, and then I was gonna, um, um, what was I going to do? Uh, I was going to um, make some, uh, like, nacho chips. Oh, oh my god. Um, and eat them with salsa chips. I mean, I was going to make some, um, cheese and spinach dip. I ate that with the nacho chips. I think I was still going to do that. <clears throat> This is my last spray. I'm gonna enjoy this with some spray. This is my last spray. There's a lot more in it than it looks. It's weird. Um. I have to go get more tomorrow. I have to. Tomorrow's gonna be Monday. I hate Monday. I forgot to mention this, but I found all of my long glasses. My tall glasses. I found them all. Not like these, not eyeglasses. Drinking glasses! I don't know, like I had so many of these. I had like four of the blue ones. I found them all. I thought it was gonna be glassless forever. Cause I actually went and invested at Walmart, by the way. Not a place that I ever shop at for anything, ever. I was so happy about this. Can you tell that I was happy about this? You don't understand what it's like to not have any glasses to drink out of. It's not cool. I ended up losing a mug in the process of all of this. A year, you guys, without glasses? I'm still a little hungry. I can't mess with this thing. It's just, it's a fever blister. If you don't know what that is, it's like the worst type of pimple to get if you have allergies. My allergies are so stinking bad. I don't even want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. Oh my god, my nose itches. I can't even talk about it. There's just another weird Sunday. I don't know what I did all day, but I talked to my mom. She's gonna go back to her blood tomorrow and I said that's gonna be pretty dangerous because coronavirus is out there and she was like my aunt was like she has to go see the doctor um because he comes from Lahore to Jorabad and I was like okay so I was like well why can't the doctor why can't you just see a doctor nearby she was like blah 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 he comes from Lahore um I was like okay um, so, anyway, um, she'll be going there, and I was like, well, please make sure that she's not alone, like, ever, like, that was not the whole point of me sending her to Pakistan, or letting her to go to Pakistan, letting her go to Pakistan, because, like, she, um, really, really wanted to go, so that's why I let her go, but she has, like, anxiety, and if she's alone, she she's like way worse off so um i was like just don't let her be alone like drop her off at uh back at like my uncle's house or just um like after you're done but don't let her stay in jorabad by herself because that's it's probably what she'll end up doing um actually is just 
being alone. So, not cool. Um, if my aunt's not with her, and my aunt has a lot of shit to do, so. <sighs> That's why I said that. So we'll see. Um, anyways, so when I got my coronavirus vaccine, here's an update on my arm. Um, it actually sort of made my skin turn black. I'm for real. Like, I, th I think it's back to normal now, like, somewhat, but it actually sort of made me, like, when I was looking in the mirror and I would, like, furrow my brows like this, it would, like, show all these weird, like, black, like, actually black spots on my face. It was so weird. Like, you know, whenever somebody dies, you know, parts of them will be blue. Well, um, and then I think, I guess, eventually they would turn black because all the cells died. And that's what it looked like. Um, I read, or I guess I watched on YouTube that, I saw a video on YouTube saying that 23 people in Norway died from after taking the vaccine. Um, so... Bibel, Bib is sleeping. <sighs> Anyways, I didn't get my curtains up. Um, so, but I'm going to before my mom comes back. Um, and uh, nothing interesting happening. What's Something interesting that mom and I talked about, I don't remember. I'm just like really ready for this quarantine situation to be over. So today is the, well now it's the 18th. Um, so yeah, mm -hmm. we have like two more months of this crap until we know for sure that like Life can resume as before. I mean, for me, there won't be like a whole lot of changes. I'm still gonna be vlogging. Um, it's not like I really miss it. There's not really a, whole, a shit ton of stuff to do anyways. Um, I miss my mom though. I don't like being alone. Like, I like having my mom here. She's good company, like, but that's like the only company that I like to keep. Um, because we're like best friends. Um, But anyways, I, I just, I miss being able to move around. The thing is, like, I just moved here, so I feel, I feel like, um, you know, I want to get out and I want to familiarize myself with the neighborhood and I like going on walks and, like, I was, I woke up earlier, or in, I woke up this morning and, like, there's bird sounds and, like, I'm a huge nature lover. So that was kind of really, really nice, but I really do like to like um, get out and like do things with my hands. I'm like a really, I'm a touchy learner, you know? So um, and uh, I don't know. Other than that, I pretty much like to stay at home. Like I'm pretty much a, uh, a homebody. I just miss going shopping and I miss like shopping for my house and decorating and yeah. 
For now, it's just going to be all rushed, like, with anything that I do. Like, with grocery shopping, which is pretty much the only thing that I'm able to do right now. So when I go do grocery shopping, everything's just going to be rushed. Um... I don't know how much more of that I can take. Like, people just, like, there's too much chaos going on. Like, just on my actual street. That, like, if I, I'm, I'm too scared to get in my car and, like, drive somewhere. Because, like, people are just, like, having more car accidents and being, like, way more freaked out. And, um, it's really distracting because you can't, like, go do the shit that you need to get done like I can't I'm too scared to go do grocery shopping because I'm afraid that I'm like I'm gonna hop in my car and somebody's just gonna like hit me and stuff that already happened one time uh, you guys you guys know like somebody backed into my truck car with their vehicle and it caused like a dent on the side of my vehicle and like because of because of the pandemic. Anyway, so the people in Norway that died. Um, the thumbnail was somebody, they were like elderly. So I'm talking like pretty old. I wouldn't even say 70s. I would say more like, like 90s or something like that. I haven't even been able to like brag about my cool recipes like I haven't been able to like do you have any cool like ramen recipes or anything I can't eat because I'm going to get fat <laughs> and like um that's just not my way of life no way so I have to like I already was like cutting down on how much um to eat and then um it's crazy basically like I'm just starving myself in here because I can't um my body's starting to like metabolize cannibalize itself because I can't like go out and like exercise I can't even go see my brother if I want to um and like my nieces and my nephew were like all in, they're all distraught because like they don't have anything to do. And like, um, I like hanging out with them and like spending like all day with them. And I can't because I can only go there for like a short time because of the, you know, because I'm scared I'm gonna die. Um, so. Anyways, everyone, I'm going to close the vlog. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys on the next vlog.